Hey guys, so I picked up this Honda engine and it's got a knock in it, which sounds a little like this. So the first thing I'm going to try is the uh, valve lash. I think it's been uh, tampered or messed with and that's just because that is not the bolt that it originally came with. So let's open it up and see if it's to spec. If you noticed, I took this off, and that's because the Hondas have the little mark right there. And that's so then you can find the top dead center. So you need to find that to set the proper lash. So you can see the exhaust intake. Just make sure it's up. Triangle's good, top dead center. There should be a little play, and this one's really tight, which might be the culprit. So this top one's just a jam nut. And this one right here is actually what, uh, what tightens it. So according to my uh, Honda spec sheet, looks like my intake I need a 0.15 millimeter and a 0.2 um, millimeter for the exhaust. 0.2 exhaust, 0.15 intake. It's pretty easy to tell which one goes which. The uh, intake is on the carburetor side, the exhaust is huh, on your exhaust side. So you do need a pair of uh, feeler gauges. Pretty much impossible to do that without it. So my exhaust was the point two. I'm going to hand tighten that. I'm gonna be able to just put it in nicely. And then I'm gonna hold this one still and tighten down the outer, the jam nut. And let's recheck that gap. Oh, it's a little tight. Can't get it in there. And the 0.15, I can't get that one in there either. Button this guy back up. In short, setting the correct lash clearance did not help. 
So the next step was to take off the shaft cover. And as you can see in the picture, the rod has some discoloration and there was definitely um, a little too much of a gap there, which is what's making the knocking sound. That's a whole nother video within itself. So we'll end it here. See you next time.